All right, guys, welcome to today's video. We're gonna do something totally different today. And this barn behind me that y'all see in so many of our videos, where we've got all of our gardening stuff and it's just kind of storage and it's tools and well, it's all kinds of stuff. We are gonna clean this thing out today and I'm gonna tell you, what was that? Yes. Okay, so she's a cleaner, an organizer, a minimalist. And I am not, but I'm going to, I will confess, this has become an absolute disaster to the fact where I can't do any work in here. I can't find anything in here. And I've enlisted her help reluctantly, but necessarily to help me straighten this out today. So guys, y'all watch this with us today and let's see what's in this barn, what we can do to make it better, what we can do to make it more functional and how to just make this a, a less difficult spot for us in our yard. So part of what our problem is, or part of what my problem is, is we have all of these boxes of pots and trays and things like that that go with the nursery. And when they come in, I don't necessarily have anything to do with them. So I just pile them in here. They take up a ton of room and then they wind up sitting here for months and nothing else in here works because they're so big. So we are gonna get everything out of here. We're gonna pull everything out of here today and start the whole thing over. Okay, good morning, y'all. I wanna show y'all we have recruited the best help in America to help us today. So y'all say hi. 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 <laughs> We've got our helpers and we're about to clean out this barn. Yes. Mr. Ron last week on the video called my husband very organized. And this morning y'all are gonna see that he's not as organized. It's not his strong suit, but hopefully we're gonna be able to help him today. And we're gonna see what interesting stuff we find. <laughs> what do y'all think we're gonna find something cool? I hope we find yeah. mice. You mice. hope you find what? Mice. Mice. Okay, because John, so what do you think we might find? A rat. A rat? <laughs> Chloe, what do you think we might find? Well, I know for a fact that there's a bunch of old bones in there that we stored in there for like years. Bones? Really? Bones. I think they're raccoon bones. Oh but my. But you're going to see. Okay, well, let's see what we you're find. We're going to try to find things that aren't super heavy that you can carry. We're getting started. And come outside with like the box of trash bags, okay? There you go, John. Move out of the way, John. Oh. Okay. Little ones. Put your hands under both of those boxes. You can get them. They're not heavy. Okay? Got it. There you go. Good job, John. Just sit right there, buddy. <laughs> sit it right there. Get it in there. Whatever you can. Okay. I wood. <laughs> I have this. You don't have to run off. All right, put your hands in. Yeah, it's not heavy. I help you together. All right, here we go. You got it? Got it. Here we go, together. One, two, three. Just wait. Go right past this big thing and sit it down. Down, down, down. There. Okay, guys, we're going to play What Is This? So I'm going to try to get it to where you can see it. Carly, can they see it? Yeah. Okay, we're trying to determine what is this. We, we don't know. John, what do you think this is? I like a smidgen. A smidgen maroon. Yes. That's a good name. A smidgen maroon. So John, what should they do if they want to tell us what this is? Comment down below. So tell us your comments. What do you think this is? Grabbing a plug tray. I know I can carry these. So my husband's always like to get old license plates. Look what I just found in there. I don't even know what year. Does it have a year on it? It says 92. But that's pretty ancient to you, Carly. Yeah. I only have so much wood. Oh, that's a lot more wood than I was expecting. 
it's getting so much better. I actually can see the barn floor. So exciting. And we fixed up the barn where the dog's dog house is in here, but cut a hole in the top so she can be seen. Carly, check her out. Oh, is she so cute? She just sits in here and watches us. She's a good supervisor. We found all these bones a long time ago, right after we moved here, when there was an old shed in the backyard. And we wound up tearing the old shed apart and making this barn out of the wood that was made out of that old shed. And we found all these bones underneath the shed and apparently still have them, including this skull. What do something. What do y'all think animal this is? Like, we can't decide what animal we think this is. So I think it's a raccoon. Me and Carly think, me and Carly and Daddy think it's a deer. Maybe yeah. it's a deer. I don't know. I think it's like, like, it's a, I don't know, like some sort of But like it's weird pack. that we found it under the barn. Correct. So, under the old barn. Because not I think, this barn. I think it's a deer, and I think that's where its antlers came out. Y'all tell me if I'm wrong, but that's what I was thinking that was. But that would be weird that we found that underneath an old shed. Yeah, I thought it was like where so, the eyes might be. Like, and then there's like little vertebrae and who knows what all these others are. Some of you bone people probably know. Right. See, that's been cut by a saw before. Yeah. So well, it's like anyway. A back thing, like a back so you never know what you're gonna find. <laughs> well, my goodness, guys, y'all are used to seeing my backyard nursery with pretty plants and stuff going on, and today. It is an absolute disaster out here. We have cleaned everything, emptied everything out of the barn. And now, inside the barn, pretty clean in here. Completely empty. Well, not really completely empty. 98% empty. So, now to sort through everything and get it organized and reload. All right, guys, so it took us more than one Saturday to get this done. Here we are a few days later in the evening having to wrap this project up. We hauled 700 pounds of garbage out of here to the dump. <laughs> yeah, to, so we, yes, and yeah, don't tell anybody. And we did a lot of organizing of what was left in here to make it so you can actually get in here. I can find everything I need. I can get in here and do whatever work needs to be done. So it's been great. And thank you everything, for helping get all this done. Everything has a home now. So put it back in its home. Don't just lay it on the table. Or on the floor. No flat surfaces. Don't lay it on the flat surface. Put it back where it belongs and you'll find what you need. So guys, thank y'all for coming along as we cleaned out our barn and made this a much more functional place to be. We appreciate y'all watching. We love y'all and we'll see you on the next one.